Suzanne in California says, my husband and I are empty nesters. We are considering downsizing to a smaller house or a condo. I understand you moved to a condo fairly recently. I would love to know how you feel about that move and the change from a house to a condo. We've never had HOA fees, and this would be a consideration as we're both seniors. Thanks for your feedback. So, uh, Suzanne, I love living in a condo. To me, it's like living in a big hotel room. You lock the door and you go. You don't have to worry about all the stuff that I had to worry about in the house. But one thing you do need to worry about up front is whatever condo community you're thinking of buying in, you need to have access to their financials. You need to know what reserves they have. Do they have a clear, honest, um, legitimate five-year plan? Like, what are they collecting to deal with maintenance issues that will occur over time? Because the time bomb in a condo, or uh, when you get hit with a giant special assessment, because the board is not doing good planning and under collecting each month, which is basically a tax, the condo fee, and then they don't have enough money in reserves when the roof needs repairing or replacing or various common elements need proper maintenance or updating or whatever. And so you want to know how financially strong the condo is, is one of the core things. But living in a condo, I love it. Now, if my wife was here and you asked her, I don't know how many times a week she says, I miss our house. I miss our house. I miss our house, which I loved, but I don't miss that house at all. 